here with Noah. All right, Noah, can you tell me what you're doing right now? So we have to find all the pins where so we can mark where each line is, like five, the 10, the 20, 25, so on. Um, well, we're digging up markers to help paint the field so we can make a, a football field on this practice field. All right, Cole, why do you need to do this? Well, we need to use, we need to mark this so we can make the white lines that we march with so we know where we're going. And we have to use this field because on Thursdays the main football field is taken. Uh, okay, Grant, what are these yellow dots for? So basically these yellow dots are where we had to dig up the markers in the field. Yellow dots are for, um, so we know where the markers are, so we can see the yellow and say uh, easily tell, okay, that's where they are. Why do you have to use a mock football field for this? Oh, because the main field's taken on Thursdays.
name is Duncan. And I'm Austin. And, and here's, here's the, the weather, weather for the weekend. weekend. Today we will have a high of 95 and a low of 74. But right now it is 87 and riding with a real feel at 94. There may also be some light rain from 6 to 7 in the evening. Tomorrow there will be a high of 92 and a low of 70. But there will also be spells of light rain and just rain from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. On Sunday there could be more spells of light rain and rain starting from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. But the high will be 91 and the low will be 75. Once again, I'm Duncan. And I'm Austin. And, and this, this has, has been, been The, the Weather. weather. Yeah, can I get a venti iced latte caramel macchiato with two shots of caramel and two shots of espresso? Girl, I don't have a clue what you just said, so I'm going to give you a venti iced water even more sophisticated, so here you go. There. I know it's you. You know what this means. Well, I have better Pokemon than you. Well, I can unadd you on Snapchat. I'm gonna unsubscribe from your YouTube. Oh yeah? Well, Jacob Sartorius is better than Justin Bieber. Oh! Do you want some water? Starbucks is filling your water. Oh, okay, thanks. This is not your paper, it's his. Then where's mine? Did you write your name on it? Probably not. It's probably this one.
my gosh, can you guys help me? I don't know where I am. Guys? Hello? Do you think Columbus is Yeah. What? Yeah, hello? Oh, hi. What's uh, pop? Uh, do you know where this is? I don't know. Have I been kidnapped? Uh, this is high school. Oh. Yeah, Alpharetta. Oh, no, no, no. Why am I here? I want you. What? Alpharetta doesn't exist. What year is it? Day? Year? Month? 2017? Duh. Okay, I'm pretty sure it's 1983, so... Well, according to my Samsung, it says it is July 18, 2017. Um... Samsung? Who's, who's Sam? It's my phone. It's, it's a, a Samsung. Samsung. Since you live under a rock, we probably need to explain some things to you. Do you know what a meme is? No. Yeah. Well, a meme. It's like, it's like you know, like a, it's like a funny joke or like an internet joke. Do you know what Snapchat is? No. Do you know what Instagram is? No, I don't think I don't know what any of this stuff is. We've been living You're under crazy. a rock. You're crazy. I have not lived under a rock. I live in a house. <laughs> Ugh, it's this one bully. Ugh, you should stand for bullies. They're trash. <laughs> there he is! Hey, you shouldn't bully people. It's rude and mean. You should s You shouldn't bully. Get out of my face, freak. You remind me of someone. I don't like you. Oh. Thank you so much for defending me. I just remembered. I have a trip that I have to go on over this weekend. Can you save my streaks? Oh, yeah, sure. Um, what's a streak? <laughs> You'll figure it out. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's hey, so are you two fun. going to that 80s party later on today? Definitely. Yeah. Radical, dude. Wait. Maybe this party can help me get back. Come on, we gotta go. Oh, okay, yeah. I'm so excited for this 80s themed party. Oh, that explains my clothes. <laughs> Do you have an appointment? I'm an old friend. I just wanted All to- All visitors must make an original- ah! Get ah! back, ah! Ralph. Go check the electric fence or something. What is it? What do you want? Hmm. My god, you've gotten fat. Come in, come in. Yes, things are going quite well. 
My God, no complaints. But you know, it is not the same. Not the same at all. Weren't you just in the news? Some show in Prague, Prague? Milan, darling, Milan. Supermodels, ha! Nothing super about them. Spoiled, stupid little stick figures with poofy lips who think only about themselves. I used to design for the gods. But perhaps you came with a challenge, eh? I was surprised to get your call. I just need a patch job. This is Mega Mash, outmoded but very sturdy, and you have torn right through it. What have you been doing, Robert? Moonlighting hero work? Must have happened a long time ago. I see. This is a hobo suit. You can't be seen in this. I won't allow it. Fifteen years ago? Maybe. But now... What do you mean? You designed I it. I never look back, darling. It distracts me from the now. You need a new suit. That much is certain. A new suit? Where the heck am I going to get a new suit? You can't. Impossible. I'm far too busy, so ask me now before I again become sane. Wait, you want to make me a suit? You push too hard, darling, but I accept. It will be bold, dramatic, heroic. Yeah, something classic, like Dinah Guy. He had a great look, oh, the cape, the boots. No capes! Isn't that my decision? Do you remember Thunderhead? Tall, storm powers, nice man, good with kids. Listen, November I... 15th of 58. <laughs> All was well, another day saved when his cape snagged on a missile thing. Mailstorm was not the brightest bulb. In the... Slipstream, April 19th, 57, Kate caught in a jet turbine. Multi-man express elevator, Dinah guy snag on a takeoff, splashdown, sucked into a vortex. No cakes! Hey, I'm Hunter. This is Group 5's Foley Project. Hope you enjoy. Do you ever have a problem when your kids are always complaining? But mom! Order now and get your special kid shock collar. Limited time only. Good afternoon. My Good name is Russell, and I'm a wilderness explorer in Tribe 54, Sweat Lodge 12. Are you in need of any assistance today, sir? No. I could help you cross the street. No. I could help you cross your yard. No. I could help you cross your porch. No. Well, I gotta help you cross something. Uh, no, I'm doing fine. Good afternoon. My uh, name uh, is uh, Russell, kid, and kid, I'm a wilderness uh, no. explorer in Tribe 54, Sweat Slow Lodge down, uh, 12. Kid! Are you in need of Thank any- Thank you, I don't need any help. Ow. Proceed. Good afternoon. But skip to the end! See these? These are my Wilderness Explorer badges. You may notice one is missing. It's my Assisting the Elderly badge. If I get it, I will become a Senior Wilderness Explorer. The Wilderness must be explored! Caw, caw, rawr! <laughs> it's gonna be great. There's a big ceremony, all the dads come, and they pin on our badges. So you wanna assist an old person? Yep. Then I'll be a senior wilderness explorer. You ever heard of a snipe? Snipe? Bird. Beady eyes. Every night it sneaks into my garden and destroys my pores alias. I'm elderly and infirm. I can't catch it if only someone could help me. Me, me, I'll do oh, it! Oh, I don't know. It's awfully crafty. You'd have to clap your hands three times to lure it in. I'll find it, Mr. Fredrickson. I think it's Burl's just two blocks down if you just go two past Two blocks it. down, got it! Snipe! Here, Snipey Snipe. Hey, I'm Josh Herring, and this is, this is Rookie Camp for Band. It started this Wednesday, and they've learned, and all these rookies have learned how to march and get comfortable with the other rookies and they've been able to get comfortable with their instruments let's take a look so what is rookie camp how would you explain it rookie camp is where you really learn how to march 
Uh, rookie camp is basically um, where new March Band members go to get initiated. Basically just a camp for all the new 8th graders coming into ninth grade who want to do marching band. So this is basically like a first try out. So what do you learn at rookie camp? Uh, we, well, we learn how to march, how to hold our instruments, and how to play the music. Um, how to do everything that the marching band does, how to position ourselves, how to walk on the field, backwards marching, forwards marching. The instructors help us a lot. So what is so critical about rookie camp? Well, if you don't attend it, and you, we have a band camp next week. If we don't know what we're doing there, we're probably going to break our legs. The um, base blocks for learning how to march. It really helps them understand all the material. Well, you need to stay in sync with everyone because then it just looks off. So what's your favorite part about Rookie Camp? Um, my favorite part is that um, you make a lot of friends here. It's just learning how to march and getting to be outside. It's probably uh, meeting all the new freshmen, seeing all these really young, energetic faces. What is it like to be a leader at Rookie Camp? Um, being a leader at Rookie Camp is a lot of fun. It's, uh, it's really nice to uh, teach these freshmen how to march and then kind of Reminisce. As you can see, the new members of the Raider Band are working hard to memorize the movements and adjust to high school marching band. Come see the Raider Band every Friday at the football games. Go Raiders! We interviewed fellow Color Guard performers and asked them about their experience in the summer program. Color Guard is just, it's fun, it's a family, it's also spinning a lot, it's also hot. It's, it's a lot of things, but yeah, it's mostly fun. I joined Color Guard because there was a friend who saw me and I told her I would go and then I didn't really plan on going, but I ended up loving it anyway and I'm really glad that happened. It's really fun and like once you do it for your first year, you've already made a bunch of friends, so it's just worth it to just keep going. We practice every Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday with the band is Tuesday and Thursday, three hours and two hour practices and they tend, some of them are in the heat of the day so they feel much worse than they are. It's actually not as hard as people would think because you know, you go over it like every count and you do it constantly so it's just stuck in your brain. We're performing for our football game performances and then we also do competitions. One exhibition, two competitions a year. One's really big in Florida. These performers work very hard in the summer heat and practice for hours so that they have flawless performances in front of their audience. They will perform their disco routine at the Alpharetta Raiders High School Games. Hey guys, it's Maya Thurman, and next week on ASA News, we're introducing a new segment called Prank Wars. Enjoy! So what is this for? Oh, it's just some random bit that we're doing. We kill the <laughs> Dude, there's something really weird here, look. So there's something in my water. I miss. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I can't believe you did this! Mr. Rice, this is a prank! 